What is up, YouTube? It is me, Jake the Happy Snake here, and welcome to part one of my Pokemon Blue walkthrough. I'm so excited to be doing a walkthrough of a game that came out 18 years ago. I just find that so awesome. It's just terrific. And by 18 years, I'm talking about Japan, not like the United States or Canada or whatever, because it came out in 1995, I believe, in Japan. I could be wrong. You can go ahead and tell me if I'm wrong, but anyways, next speed is gonna be fast. The battle animation will be on. Battle style will be shift. I'm not. I still don't know what that means after playing Pokemon for so many years. I don't know what battle shift means, but anyways. So yeah, hello there. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People call me the Pokemon Proof. Yes, you have a yes. Yes, there is a lot of proof that you that you are an idiot. This world is inhabited by creatures called Pokemon. And guys, I hate to say it, but I've never, ever completed a Pokemon game that's based on the Kanto region. Never, ever have I done that. Never beaten one ever that's been based on the Kanto region. Unless if you consider her Gold, Soul, Silver, um, you know, games from the Kanto region. But, yeah, I've ne never done it. Uh, let's say myself, JTHS, of course. I do own Pokemon Blue that I... I haven't played for quite a few months. Um, actually, I've gotten away from Pokemon. That's why I haven't been uploading any videos for a while. Uh, because I've gotten away from Pokemon. But the closest I've ever been to completing a Pokemon game is getting six gym badges. Almost seven. In, um, Pokemon Blue. In the actual, like, not in the ROM or anything. In the actual game. Alright, guys, sorry about that. I had to stop the video for a second because I thought somebody was calling me. I hate that when I make it a video and I hear my parents or somebody trying to get my attention. It really bugs me. Anyways, um, so yeah, this guy's been my rival since I was a baby. That's really... How are you rivals when you're babies? You, like, hit each other over the head with toys or something? Like that? that doesn't make sense to me. Um, yeah, so he cannot remember his own grandson's name. That's so... That's nice. That's really nice that you can't remember... Your own grandson's name. You are a legit idiot. Anyways, um, no. What am I doing? No. What? Pokemon. Wow, that's stupid. Uh, yeah. Let's go with lowercase. So I guess. Wait, don't no, we'll go up. Okay. Seriously, I never thought of a name, but I think we'll name him. Uh, uh I'll name him after my brother because I'm really close to my brother. So yeah, we'll name him after him. And there goes my phone. Okay, I'll be right back, guys. Alright, sorry about that, guys. That was just my friend calling me. Um, literally, like, I hope I get no more disruptions. That's the second disruption in, I don't know how many minutes. Five minutes, I don't know, I, I can't tell how long I've, I've been recording this, so, whatever. Anyways, Tyler, I really hope I can get through this video without getting dis getting interrupted again. That will really bug me. Alright, Tyler, okay, good. My rival's name is Tyler. That's the name, that's the name of my one and only brother. He used to be a fan of Pokemon. His favorite game was Pokemon Yellow, but he only played the first generation games like Red and Yellow and stuff like that. Alright, your Pokemon, your very own Pokemon Legend is about to unfold a world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Oh, let's go! And then you turn into a, a young little boy. And I'm not sure if you guys have heard, but today is the day that they release Pokemon X and Y today. It's stupid! It's stupid! I have to say, it's really stupid that they released the, that, that like they didn't release them, but they announced them. Like I'll explain more about that a little later. But look, it's N64, I think it is, a TV, and yeah, just a bunch of crap. But seriously, this is it's stupid. They released the fifth generation like uh, a couple years ago. They used to release new generations every like they used to announce them every you know four or five years. But seriously, two years? Like, come on. But I am definitely going to get them. They're for the 3DS. I do have a 3DS. Um, but anyways, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Uh, let's go in the grass. Oh, wait, you, we can't do that because Professor Oak is, like, yelling at us because we don't have a Pokemon and stuff like that. Yeah. Okay, anyways. Uh, it's unsafe. Wow, Pokemon live in the tall grass. Oh, my goodness. Thank you for telling me something that, I, that I've had to listen to you repeat about 50,000 times. Thank you. Here, come with me. Oh, oh, crap. Okay. Alright. Anyway, so now we go in his little thing. His little his little lab thing. I don't know. Grips! I'm fed up with waiting! Alright. You can have it your way, I guess. 
Anyways, um, there are three Pokemon here. Oh wow, thank you for telling me. I, I I can't see or anything. I'm blind. Sorry, I can't see anything. When I was young, when I was young, I was a serious Pokemon trainer. You were young. Can you believe this guy was actually young? Okay. Hey, Gramps, what about me? All right, yeah, be patient. You can, okay, all right. Anyways, so yeah, there are three Pokemon here. There is Charmander. I'm not sure why I paused when I said Charmander. Um, no, because that is way too, that Pokemon is way too popular. There's Squirtle. Um, I may consider picking him. And there's Bulbasaur. And I might pick this guy, actually. Um, yeah, I think, well, no, I'm not choosing Bulbasaur, we'll choose this guy. Yeah. Because, why do you have to show his info before I choose him? Like, come on. Like, they don't do that in the new games, seriously. Did you just receive a Squirtle? And no, I'm not nicknamed him. Thank you. But, yeah, thank you very much, but I'm good. And I don't really, I kind of, like, I chose a Water-type Pokemon in my last walkthrough. So twice, choosing a Water-type Pokemon twice in a row doesn't really sit that well with me, but, you know, I'm actually more of a fan of, of Grass-type. And that's the, the type that my brother chose. Thank you, Bulbasaur. I mean, I can't even think of his own name. I've eaten so much chocolate tonight, guys. Don't, you know... If I seem like I'm really hyper, I apologize. Anyway, so before we can do anything, uh, your rival's gonna stop you, and he's gonna, like, I don't know, come over and just, I don't know, punch you in the face or something. I don't know, I'm not really sure what he's gonna do. Anyway, so we're now in the battle, and yeah, Tyler wants to fight. He said a Bulbasaur! Oh man, I would have never expected that. Squirtle, wow. Look at Squirtle, he looks, he looks retarded. Anyways, we'll use Tackle. Growl, yep, go ahead, you can use Growl. I don't care, I don't care, you can keep using Growl, but I'm, I, I will eventually kill you. Come on, critical hit. How are you, f come on! Twice in a row, how is that fair for me? I totally, holy crap, I said hopefully I'll get a critical hit, and look what happens, I get a critical hit. You, you, now you can't get more luckier than that, you really can't. His first move, it does three damage. Good job there, buddy. Again, twice in a row? How is that fair for me? I have a feeling I might not win this. <clears throat> Alright. <clears throat> Excuse me. Growl failed. Actually, I might win this. Like, one more tackle should do the trick. Take that, you stupid sucker. Well, this guy, I'm pretending this guy's my brother, so I shouldn't really call him that. Anyways, level six. JT just defeated Tyler. I knew I would do it. What? Unbelievable! I picked the wrong Pokemon! You always say that. Always. Every time. Anyways. So he's gone. So now we can just... Yeah, I guess we can just walk out of the building. Anyways. So yeah. Time to continue on with our adventure! And, uh... What, what, what do we do next? Yeah, you can go in here and get a town map. No, wait, no, you can't. Sorry. So, okay, stop. Thank you. Thank you. I don't want to talk to you. Goodbye. Alright. Anyways. And yeah, so what are we doing? We're gonna go out in the grass. Let's go, guys! Alright, guys. Sorry about that. I had to pause the video again. Or, I guess, really stop the video again. Because my dad was coming home from work and... Well, the, you, you can't really count that as an interruption. I just wanted to tell him that I was recording a video because he's known to, like, interrupt me, like, all the time. Anyways. So yeah, Wild Pidgey at level 3. Let me see. I can't really catch him, so I might as well attack the guy. Yeah, let's just do that. Critical oh, look, critical hit, yeah. Gust, okay. Did you did you guys know that in these old games that Gust was actually considered a normal type move? Because I don't know if there was flying type move. Maybe there was. Yeah, there was. There was, there, there was fly, right. Forgot about that. Anyways. Um, 20 their experience points? Yeah, that was terrible. I don't even know why I battled that Pidgey. That was kind of pointless. Yeah. Anyways. Hopefully I can get, finish this walkthrough, because I've never ever been able to finish a Pokemon... Like, I've never been able to finish a Kanto region game. Because I got stuck, um, in that little mansion by the 7th gym. I got stuck in that in my, in my actual po Pokemon Blue game. So, once I get to that point, I'm just probably just going to search it up on the internet or something. So, yeah. Wow, Pidgey appeared! Oh my gosh! Okay. 
and we can run from, from that, obviously. I uh, can't go over there, okay. Come on! I'm just gonna speed through it. There we go. Alright, he's gone. Goodbye, Reddy. And look, we're in a Viridian, I think, are we? Or... Oops. Okay. Uh, do I need to heal? Let me see. Pokemon. Yeah, we might as well heal, just in case, you know. Just in case something bad happens. You never, you never know what you, what we really have to do. Yeah, heal. Okay. Boom. Okay. And, yeah, fighting bit. We hope to see you again. I hope to never see you again. All of a sudden, I'm going to have to. I would love to do a walk here without going in the Pokemon Center. That'd be great. Anyway, so you got to go in the, in the mart here. Because this little guy is going to yell at you. And you have to. he's going to give you a package of some sort. Or parcel or whatever the crap you want to call it. I'm not really sure. Anyways, now we can walk out of there and yeah, let's continue. Woohoo! Let's be like the pill. Let's be like the Pillsbury Doughboy. Woohoo! Okay, yeah, no, that that was really lame. All right, and we're all we are almost home, guys. Almost home. Okay, and now we got a force to go through grass. Yeah, the what Pokemon? That's so. That's how skilled I am at this game. Yeah, I'm I'm, I'm that skilled. Okay, anyways, uh, okay, I gotta walk up, and you see two Pokedexes. I think that's what they are on the table over there. They look like faces. They look, they actually look like faces. That's kind of funny. Anyways, JTHS delivered Oaks parcel. Yeah, yeah, I did. I did that. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, you're welcome. Raps. And here comes Tyler. What did you call me for? All right, I have a request for two of you. On the desk, there are my, I mean, is my invention. Pokedex. It's like he's screaming it out out loud. Like it's like it's so like huge huge bold letters. Like come on, man. Take these with you. JT just got a Pokedex from Oak. But, I'm too old. I can't do it. Yeah, you are old. You're very old. Very, very old. This game is for 18 years old. Of course you're gonna be old. My goodness. Alright, Gramps, leave it up to me. JT, just, I hate to say it, but I don't need you. Thank you. My own brother saying that. I appreciate it. Anyways. Okay, so we are, we've gotten rid of him, and, um, I guess we can conclude the first part. So thanks everybody for watching. Uh, stay tuned for more videos, and we'll see. We will see you all next time. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and we will see you all next time.